Hi, I'm Joel, I'm the lab manager here at Liberty and I'm responsible for creating frac fluids. Today we're going to make a frac fluid out of some simple ingredients that you can get at the local grocery store. I have four ingredients here. Um, I have guar gum powder, I have a baking soda um, cleaner that uh, you can use and I have some, some eye drops, and finally I have some vinegar. Um, I'm just gonna start by adding some water to my blender cup. Uh, one cup of tap water. Turn it on, get the blender going. Take my water powder, add about a half a teaspoon Get it in there. Uh, guar is a, a natural polymer that grows in a plant that's typically found in India. Um, it's an, you know, it's used as a thickening agent in a lot of uh, a lot of food products such as salad dressing. It's also used in in toothpaste, um, and it's also found in my my favorite product, ice cream. So. Um, but it does take a little while to thicken the water. So what I've done is. Um, started this a little bit earlier. I have uh, pre-made this. As you can see, the guar has thickened the water a little bit, but it's still pretty fluid, and um, it's not quite as thick as what we want uh, frac fluid to be. So I'm gonna have to add my other ingredients. My second ingredient is gonna be the hand cleaner. It has um, some baking soda in it that's gonna that's gonna raise the uh, the pH a little bit. I add another half a teaspoon of this, and that's gonna bump up the pH pretty quickly. And then uh, the final or the third ingredient, anyways, um, it, that I'm gonna add is the the, the eye drops. I add another half a teaspoon of this, and what this the eye drops have uh, boron in it that acts as a preservative in the eye drops, but in the, in the frac fluid, it's actually gonna add, uh, it's gonna bind the, uh, the guar polymer together and make it really thick. So it's happening pretty quickly. As the, uh, the fluid gets thick. starts to get really thick and kind of fun to play with. And this is an example of a, of a, a pretty thick frac fluid. Um, actual, you know, thickness of a frac fluid can be controlled um, depending on the geologic conditions. Um, but this, uh, we make the fluid thick so that you can carry a uh, propent down into the into the well and, and, and hold open the fractures. But the fluid is a little bit too thick to allow oil and gas to come back out of the fractures, so we want to make it a little bit thinner. And the way we do that is to add our, uh, our vinegar. We're just gonna add another half teaspoon of this and this will lower the pH and um, make the fluid thin again. So when the fluid gets thin, it allows the oil and gas to come back out or penetrate through the, through the, uh, the fluid and, and back up to the surface, leaving the, the sand to prop open the, the fractures. And so now you can see that the, uh, the fluid is thin again. And uh, that's how we make grocery store frac fluid. Yeah, it's pretty simple. I, I appreciate you guys watching. And if you want to learn more about, about fracking, frack fluids, please go to our website, libertyfrack.com. Thanks.